Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Privileges provide various levels of permission to create, edit, and delete database objects. The exact types of permissions that can be granted will vary depending upon the relational database management system you are using. You must check the specific RDBMS documentation to be sure which privileges are available. The following table lists commonly used privileges that will often be implemented within relational database management systems that support DCL statements. The Create privilege allows users to create objects, often cited as Create Database Object, where the database object parameter is the type of database object that the privilege allows them to create. Also cited as Create All, to allow the user to create any type of database object. The alter privilege allows users to alter objects, often cited as alter database object, where the database object parameter is the type of database object that the privilege allows them to alter. Also cited as alter all, to allow the user to alter any type of database object. The drop privilege allows users to delete objects, often cited as drop database object where the database object parameter is the type of database object that the privilege allows them to delete. Also cited as drop all to allow the user to delete any type of database object. The insert privilege allows the user to insert records into a table. The update privilege allows the user to update records within a table. The delete privilege allows the user to delete records within a table. The select privilege allows the user to select records within a table. And the execute privilege allows a user to execute a stored procedure or function within the database. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.